Okay, in this video, I will be drawing thoracic anatomy as seen on a chest x-ray. So I've copied this uh, chest x-ray from internet with kind permission, of course, and this is layer one. So I'll lock this layer and I'll create a new layer, layer two, and I'm working on layer two. No fill, black stroke, and pen tool. I'll start from the hilum, right hilum, and before I do that, I think I need to tell you that the stroke weight is three points and I've selected this biconvex profile. Okay, so starting from the right hilum and I'll go towards the apex of right lung, <coughs> lateral border of right lung and then right costophrenic angle. I'll have to click on this anchor point to change the angle of the uh, line and I'm drawing a right hemidiaphragm and again click on this anchor point and then the medial border of the right lung. I'll do the same thing, we start from left hilum and apex, left apex, click one more time, left costrophenic angle, click one more time, the left cardio diaphragmatic angle, left hemidiaphragm and then click one more time there's some part of the lung that is located behind the heart which is known as retrocardiac lung and i'll leave this shape as it is without closing it okay so, I've, I, so these two shapes are open shapes they're not closed okay so that is how they look like now Okay, so I'll create another layer and I'll draw, I'll hide this layer as well. And I'll, I'll lock this one and I'm working on layer three. I'm going to draw cardiac shadow. This is superior vena cava where superior vena cava, cava comes and meets right atrium. So this is the right heart border. So this is the right heart border on this chest x-ray, right atrium. This is where superior vena cava enters into the right atrium. And I'm drawing the anterior part of the arch of aorta. So this is, uh, this is ascending aorta here. This is arch of aorta. <coughs> Yeah. And then left atrial appendage, arch of aorta one more time, left atrial appendage and left ventricle. <clears throat> okay. And this point has to be a bit smoother. Okay, so let's see Okay, so I'm gonna fill this layer, this shape. This shape with slightly gray color. Okay, and the heart lungs should be (coughs) 
length should be slightly okay all right so these are the two major organs that are now visible on this sketch so i'm going to draw trachea as well so i have to make it invisible lock this one lock this one invisible and create another layer so this is layer four okay and which is on top so this lock uh, layer is locked layer four and i'll again no fill black stroke and this is trachea and this is where trachea enters into the right lung and i'll change the profile and i want this triangular profile to be used for trachea the other wall of the trachea and this is where it is entering the left lung and this is crina angle of crina which is usually normally should not be more than 70 degrees i think i have drawn the correct position of the okay so that is a bit better i think So we have drawn a sketch of lung and heart and trachea with the help of HS X-ray in few minutes only. Thank and I'll upload this uh, sketch uh, under Creative Commons 3 license on Pixabay website and I hope people can use it. Thank you very much.